Lightburn's power scaling feature allows you to customize the power output of any shape in your workspace. Unlike the usual method of setting power in the cuts and layers window for an entire layer, this works on a per shape basis. Power scaling is not visible in the default Lightburn workspace layout. To enable it, head up to the window dropdown menu and select Shape Properties. This will open a tabbed Shape Properties window on the right side of your workspace. It will appear blank until you select a shape to make it active. To apply a power scale, edit the text box from the default 100 to a smaller number. The value set here scales power output by a percentage between a given layer's min and max power settings. For a G-code or Galvo system, min power is always zero, so the power scale is always a percentage of max power. For DSP devices, however, min power is set by the user. To keep it simple, on either G-code or Galvo devices, a power scale of 50% would be 50% power if your layer's total power was set to 100%. On a DSP machine with min power set to 50 and max 100%, a power scale of 50 would output 75% power. One application of this feature is making highly customized material test grids. Lightburn has a built-in material test tool that works well for most scenarios, but if you want to use shapes other than rectangles or set specific spacing, you can accomplish that with power scaling. Another great use is for complex engravings with widely varying shape sizes. For the smaller shapes, the laser will not be able to fully get up to speed, which can cause scorching on some materials. Instead of putting the smaller shapes on their own layer, leading to an increase in job time from the added travel moves, you can select them and apply a power scale. This allows the laser to maintain an efficient path while dropping laser output when passing over the smaller shapes. The result is an optimized job giving you the best quality and quickest runtime possible. Now you know how power scaling works and how to use it to create highly customized jobs. Be sure to subscribe for more great videos on Mastering Lightburn.